Yeah, yeah, look at the frost on that. Look at the ice on that. Solid ice almost. So I feel. Let's have a look at the temperature. Minus three, that's minus three. Three and a half, minus three and a half, minus. As I say, I've never known I'd get that cold. Well, you can see how much frost is on there and there's no water. I've just got this to catch in case any water did drip down. No water's dripped down. But you see how much frost and ice is on there, how much build up there is. And that's only since I removed quite a bit of the heat sink paste I've got on. This is the heat sink paste I've used, was using. That's better. HY510 Thermal Grease, they call it. Comes in like a syringe like this. That's what I had on. Now, without checking the resistance of that, I don't know if it was like the electricity was conducting across or something and taking up quite a bit of power. I'll test that just now. Right, I've put some of this heatsink paste down here and I've got this on Conunity. Nothing. I might be touching the tips together there. And there. So no, it's, take my word, it's not showing any homage there. It's total resistance. Short to you. So it does show the resistance even on conuninity. I put on normal resistance. So no, it wasn't shortened out with the heat sink paste. So it's actually removal of the heat sink paste that's got it to frost up this much, what it seems to be to me.